Another Jacksonville Sheriff's Office uh, employee has been arrested. This after police say one of their officers was drinking and driving off duty. News for Jacks reporter John Acebus spoke with the sheriff following the arrest. Monday, Sheriff TK Waters stepped to the podium to talk about one of his officers being arrested on Saturday, suspected of drinking and driving. Officers and paramedics responded to a call reporting an individual slumped over the steering wheel of a, of a running truck. According to an arrest report, the officer was found sitting in the driver's seat of a silver F-150 and told Jacksonville Fire and Rescue first responders that he was an active employee with the Jacksonville Sheriff's Office. It goes on to say a neighbor first saw him park at 1245 in the afternoon and at times was doing weird things with his hands and believed the suspect was either drunk or on drugs. This is the ninth arrest of a JSO employee by this agency this here. The last arrest was Officer John Luna on June 9th, who was arrested on a domestic battery charge. Before that, an officer was arrested on May 20th when Alan Lesage was arrested, accused of running tags on parked cars in his ex-girlfriend's apartment complex while off duty. Then on April 29th, corrections officer Kobe Collette was arrested, accused of smuggling drugs. And then on April 20th, John Burr was arrested, accused of hit and run in a patrol SUV. I want the public to know that we caught him and uh, he's, he's been arrested as he should be. According to News for Jack's records, this is the 12th JSO employee arrested in 2024. That is just one behind the total in 2023 and tied for the entire amount of 2022. When Sheriff Waters took the role of sheriff two years ago, he promised transparency. And when it comes to officers and JSO employees, he's stepping up to the mic. Everyone knows what they're supposed to do. We're not dealing with children. We're dealing with adults who are given a responsibility, a very powerful responsibility to hold people accountable. But you're going to be held accountable if you do the wrong thing. Reporting in Jacksonville, John Acebus, Channel 4, The Local Station.